world, how you doing? Thank you for joining in the PBTV World News. It's your boy T Butter, aka The Solution. And it's your boy Puba, aka The Problem, giving you news that you can use. There you go. We're going to start off with news coming from Philly. Hey. The, the mayor of Philly had a screening of the Wire finale in City Hall. <laughs> the mayor said, I think that this is very exciting for the city. New mayor, Michael Nutter. New mayor, Michael Nutter? Yeah, new. Brand well, new. Well, you know what? Mr. Michael Nutter, this is your first and at the same time last term in office. Are you serious? The Wire at City Hall? Let me tell you something. You could take someone out of the ghetto, but you can never take the ghetto and foolishness out of that person. And that's all I have to say for Mr. Nutter. And all I have to say is you can take the jungle, excuse me, you can take the monkey out the jungle. Can't take the jungle out that monkey. Shame on you, mayor. Yep. But don't be mad. UPS is hiring. <laughs> <laughs> all right, moving along. Let's get to political news. Politics, our favorite half-breed mutt. Mr. Barack Obama, he's back in the news, but you know what? It's not all good for Barack. Hillary is closing in. Hillary has halted Barack Obama's run of 11 primary victories with three of three wins out of four states. Now, Obama is still slightly ahead in the delegates uh, who will, will ultimately, you know, um, choose a Democratic nominee. But Hillary is right behind him, and I think reality for white America has just set in. Yeah, I mean, they finally realized that this is not a very, very good tan. <laughs> that this man is actually black. Oh, wait a minute. Is that a black man? <laughs> hey, Jeb. We're going to put a spook in the office. <laughs> oh. hey, right. You hey, still got a chance, Barack, but I don't chance. know. Hey, lighten up your photos. Do something. Moving on. Celebrity news. Kelly Roto. Oh, Ooh. Kelly Roto. Who's that? Kelly Rowland says, I feel complete of after surgery. Okay, Kelly Rowland told People Magazine that she had plastic surgery to bring her from oh, an yeah. A cup to a B cup. Wow. Yeah, she said she didn't want to have double Ds and be a little bitty size too. That would look nuts. So she said, I'm not going to go too far. Mm -hmm. you know, I'm just going to get, you know, an A. To a B, be I mean, honest. I mean, at least a C, though. If you're gonna go under the knife, I mean, get a C. Mm -hmm. But now, well, well, Kelly, you got your, uh, you got your implant, so that's good. So now you're almost there. Now you just need to do one more thing. What's that? Get in contact with Ashanti's publicist, who has no talent at all, as well, mm -hmm. and ask who you need to sleep with or get in bed with, so you can get your hit record. And also forward your publicist to. Poopabutter.com <laughs> and we'll make sure that um, we work something out for you. Yeah. Sports! Mm. Mentally tired. Brett, I'm, I'm sick of this guy. <laughs> Brett Favre so is retiring again. He tells the Packers that his playing career is over. The Green Bay Packers quarterback quit after a 17th season career. Brett Favre, quote, I know I can still play, but like I told my wife, I'm just tired mentally. I'm just tired, end quote. Now, what is he tired of, the game or his wife? I think he's just mentally tired of his wife. He probably said <laughs> that just laying in bed. She said, hey, Brett, you know the garbage is stinking in the kitchen. I need you to go. He said, damn it, you know what? I'm, I'm just mentally tired right now. I'm just tired. And she called the papers. She called the papers and told him he was retiring. And, you know, before you know it, it was too late. And he had to just roll with it. That's what women will do for you. Meow, 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 meow. Meow, 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 meow. So in short, Brett Favre, we see you next season. Yeah, basically. Like with, we always do. With your new wife. <laughs> <laughs> Moving along, the Little Wayne. Wayne's, Wayne's World. World. Let's get into some Little Wayne foolishness. I called my name. You said, what's up? I said. <laughs> <laughs> Little Wayne filed a motion in court to reduce a drug charge from uh, just to possession. Um, Little Wayne was arrested January 22nd in Arizona. And when wow. they, let me tell you what they found when they searched his tour bus. Four ounces of marijuana, one ounce of cocaine, 41 grams of ecstasy, and a 40 caliber pistol. Are you serious? 
Now, why does he have all these things? What is he using that for? I don't know, but maybe he is really this gangster rapper. Maybe he's maybe he's living his life. Or maybe he found out that, you know what? Platinum records, money, nothing is going to make these women sleep with me. <laughs> so take give him some <laughs> drugs, some ecstasy. Smoke some of this weed. Please. Sniff some coke. Take this pill. Swallow pill. Please. I'm not that ugly, trust me. <laughs> After you take this, I'll look a lot better. <laughs> and if you don't, I'll what? I'll shoot you. <laughs> ugly money, young money, ugly money. <sighs> well, now it comes one of my favorites and dear personal parts of the show. Birthday time. Birthday time, happy birthday. Hey, happy birthday. So you know, this is the part of the show where we just want to give a shout out to all of our MySpace friends who have mm -hmm. birthdays this week. Mm -hmm. Their pictures will be listed on our page under our top friends this week. Now, if you have a birthday coming up, be sure to add us as a friend and we'll do the same for you. Yeah, check them out. We got some beautiful people there. So if you want to see what they're about, go to our page, you see them, check them out. And unfortunately for you, this ends the week in review. Yes, 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 yes. But tune in next week for some more world news given to you the Pooba Butter way. It's your boy T Butter. And it's your boy Pooba signing out. Signing out. See you next week, baby. Peace.